This is Wonder TV Africa, and welcome to our first session of the Eye to the Sky program. I am Cephas Simon, and I am here to explain the history of mousetraps and how the mousetrap works. There's an old saying which states that if you build a better mousetrap, the world will beat a path to your door. This highlights humanity's continued dedication to trapping invasive rodents. It's little wonder why people are so dedicated to taking care of rodent problems. Rats and mice are an incredibly invasive species. Without prompt action, a single breeding pair of rodents can quickly become a huge problem. The earliest moments in history can be rather fuzzy. The historic record often lacks some of the more commonplace activities in our lives. This is in large part simply due to the fact that people rarely document activities that they'd consider unremarkable. For example, consider how often you've written down how a mailbox works. This may well be why we have so little documentation about the earliest forms of rat and mouse traps. The earliest mention of a rat or mouse trap occurs in the ancient Greek Petraeca Myomoka. The work is typically dated to somewhere between the 6th through 4th centuries BCE. The document mentions a wooden trap that functions as a destroyer of mice. Documents dating back to the 17th century use mouse traps as an illusion or to illustrate a point. For example, Shakespeare's Hamlet uses the term to illustrate the idea of a play within a play. The 19th century sees the three musketeers using the term mouse trap in a chapter title but we don't see a technical description of a working mousetrap until 1894. Today our main focus is going to be on a spring rat trap, and we are going to use an animation made by Creative Blender Designs. What's a spring trap? Spring traps for large rodents, such as rats or squirrels, are powerful enough to break the animal's neck or spine. They may break human fingers as well whereas an ordinary spring-based mousetrap is very unlikely to break a human finger. A bite attached to the trap is used to attract rodents, and are trapped immediately after making any movement to the rat trap trigger. This is all we had for our first session of Eye to the Sky. I remain Cephas Simon in 4 Wonder TV Africa.